In this video, I'll teach you how to create a Project Web App login account in Microsoft Project. Before you can use your copy of Microsoft Project with either Project Online or Project Server, you must first create a Project Web App login account in Microsoft Project. In this video, I'll teach you how to do it. The good news is you only need to do this once. So let's get started. Before you can create your Project Online login account in Microsoft Project, you'll need to obtain the URL of Project Web App from your application administrator. You can see that in this text file, I've obtained the URL and I've copied it into the text file. If the URL includes the text default.aspx, you'll need to delete that from the URL and also delete that trailing forward slash as well. Then go ahead and copy the URL to your Windows clipboard. Next, launch your Microsoft Project desktop application. If Microsoft Project displays the welcome page in the backstage, such as I see, go ahead and open a new blank project. Then click File, Info, Manage Accounts. In the Project Web App Accounts dialog, click the Add button. Enter a friendly name in the account name field, such as Project Online. In the Project Server URL field, go ahead and paste the URL that you copied that is the URL of your Project Online system. Leave the Set as Default Account checkbox selected and then click the OK button. Finally, Make sure you select the option in the lower left corner called Choose an Account and then click the OK button. Finally, exit Microsoft Project completely. Next, go ahead and launch Microsoft Project again. This time Microsoft Project will display a login dialog. In the login dialog, you should see the friendly name of your Project Online instance in the Profile Pick list. Also, you'll find a checkbox option called Load Summary Resource Assignments. I personally recommend that you deselect that option because it'll cause you more problems than it's worth. I'll ask you to trust me on that. Then, go ahead and click the OK button. Microsoft Project will finish launching and it'll connect you to your Project Online system. If you see the welcome page in the backstage, such as I do, go ahead and open a new blank project again. To show you that you are successfully connected to Project Online, look in the lower left corner of your Microsoft Project application window. There you'll find an icon that looks like a globe with a check mark in front of it. If you float your mouse pointer over that icon, you'll see the words connected to along with the friendly name of your Project Online login account. At this point, you're ready to begin using your copy of Microsoft Project with the Project Online system in your organization. Now you know how to create a Project Web App login account in your copy of Microsoft Project. Once you've done this, you can now begin using Project Online or Project Server. I appreciate you watching this video. If you found it helpful, please give it a like. If you're not already subscribed to my YouTube channel, please consider subscribing and clicking the notification button. And if you do have questions about Project Online or Project Server, please write them in the comment section below. And as always, I'll see you in my next video.